hey everyone welcome back to code with Yusuf channel in this video we will create the sequence diagram for online shopping in previous videos we created this uh, activity diagram use case diagram uh, class diagram er diagram uh, you have the link for those videos in the description so in this video we will create the sequence diagram for online shopping so let's start before starting please subscribe our youtube channel uh, first of all uh, i will draw the uh, sequence diagram then i will explain uh, every step in sequence diagram okay <coughs> a sequence diagram is used uh, to show the interactions between object and the sequential order that those interaction occur okay it is the sequence diagram uh, in the sequence diagram we have vertical line and sequential uh, horizontal line the vertical are the process or object with us and the horizontal line show the message or uh, transfer the message so for the online shopping first uh, i will create the sequence diagram for the search catalog whenever a customer come and he is searching okay he is searching in the catalog so i will create the sequence diagram for searching catalog so first i will drag the customer the actor here okay customer so now let's drag the lifeline this line show the lifeline of this customer okay the second process with us is cat catalog let's catalog okay the third process is product so the lifeline of customer will start here so let's track here the customer what the customer will do customer will search Product okay and fast string. And then the lifeline of catalog will start here. And here a message will go to the product. Yeah, to get info. Get info. To get info from the product so here the lifeline of product will start so back a message will come from the product side to the catalog what it will do it will return full product also a message from catalog will come to the customer here product info so this was the use case diagram for uh, searching catalog okay so now we will create the a use case diagram for add items to the shipping card here also first we will drag the customer let's try that and draw the lifeline for customer and the second process will be shopping cart the third process will be the item so first of all the 
customer will add item to the shopping cart so let's create a message here and start the lifeline of customer ID and quantity this will pass to okay so now the message will goes from shopping cart let's tag the lifeline of shopping cart and the message will goes to the item So here verify item okay so here should move it here because here if the item was out of stock So then it should return a message. Yeah, out of stock. A verification message will come and here another message will come just to describe that operation success or fail yes so it was about add items in shopping cart was the sequence diagram for it so now let's create the sequence diagram for the checkout and place order so we have these processes and objects so let's create now the messages between them so first message will be from the customer side to the shopping card that will be get item the customer will get the items message back from shopping cart okay another message will be for uh, billing address message will goes back to the customer because it will get the billing info from customer and another message will be back that is getting shipping info okay get shipping info so now a message will goes to the order that will be create order and it will pass the item billing info and address So now a message will go to verify the item.
verify the item then a message will come back that will be verification status If the items were not available, then a message will go to the customer out of stock. So now a message will go from order to payment. It will process payment. message will come back that will be about payment status if there was an error the message will goes to the customer If there was no error, a message will go to the shipment. Process shipment. Message will come back for shipment status. Then a message will come to the customer about order status.